Today, a revolution in flight simulation technology is quietly underway. One of the most critical parts of pilot training is the use of full motion flight simulators that provide the pilot with flying experience on the ground. Flight simulation is a challenging motion control application because the experience must be highly realistic as well as safe, quiet, and smooth. In this pilot training center, some of the world's first all-electric high payload flight simulators have assumed the roles usually associated with hydraulic systems. Electric technology offers significant advantages in high payload simulator performance, starting with a more realistic flying experience that more closely matches the aircraft's performance. But changing the face of flight simulator technology didn't come easy. It took a team of engineers willing to take risks, put in many sleepless nights, and change the rules to make these all-electric high payload systems a reality. Flight Safety International, or FSI, is the world's premier aviation training organization. In business since 1951, more than 75,000 pilots, technicians, and aviation professionals train at flight safety facilities each year. Meet Ron Jansen, Director of Engineering, and Dr. Nadal Samur, Chief Technologist of FSI. Ron and Nadal clearly understood the advantages of electric motion systems and sought to bring them to high payload applications. The electric motion simulator was a concept that we developed about five years ago. We had decided that uh, after looking around that the electric simulator was a viable solution. The technical challenge of moving from hydraulic to electric was huge. It meant designing an electric system that could support a full simulator payload of up to 25,000 pounds and ensuring the system had the same response of a hydraulic system. In doing the system, we had to also uh, realize the fact that it's a massive undertake. It's a huge project. And if we were to develop every little piece of software or even some of the hardware by ourselves, it would not have been done. It required the expertise and insight of a proven leader in motion bases and control loading, as well as all electric high performance systems and deep knowledge of flight simulation applications. The reason Flight Safety decided to work with Moog is because of the long lasting relationship that we had on the hydraulic side. The decision was really easy because we trusted their uh, engineering personnel, we trusted their management, and they knew exactly what we are looking for. Creating an all-electric, high payload simulator motion base meant taking a proactive approach and using out-of-the-box thinking. After all, there was no precedent for what they were designing. Deadlines were tight technical challenges were daunting and both teams had to make a substantial financial investment to do what no one had ever done before. It was one of the most significant engineering projects ever undertaken by FSI and Moog FCS. It meant starting from scratch to design an array of all new technical systems that would ensure a high-speed, high-force system that matches the real aircraft experience. We really did not know uh, the end, how the, the final product is going to look like. We didn't anticipate all the hurdles that we're going to face. So it was very critical that we identify people who are capable of certain things in our company and at, at Moog. In May 2006, the hard work of Moog FCS and FSI teams were rewarded when the Federal Aviation Administration of the United States granted the first Level D certification to an all-electric high payload flight simulator. The simulator also earned the American military's Ready for Training designation. Despite widespread doubt that any all-electric simulator would qualify for extremely stringent FAA Level D certification, the Moog FCS and FSI teams achieved it. This certification is the gold standard in pilot training, allowing the pilot to log his flying hours for his license without getting on a plane. The all-electric simulators incorporate key high-performance features, including 
36 and 60 inch actuators and innovative joint assemblies for realistic motion. High voltage brushless servo motors and servo drives and new ball screw technology for smoother performance. Motion control software with high speed communication protocols for superior response. Pilots will undoubtedly feel the benefits of the world class technology at their disposal. Today, the impossible dream of Moog FCS and FSI engineers is poised to become the industry standard. I think the customers will be very much more satisfied with their product. They have less infrastructure to build to accommodate the simulators. Performance is going to be better than the hydraulics and the maintenance requirements are going to be lower than what the hydraulics were. I feel extremely proud and extremely excited about uh, being part of that team that have accomplished this. I'm not sure we would have accomplished what we have accomplished uh, without uh, Moog FCS. This is probably once in a lifetime event.